Hi, I'm Professor Matthew Bales, and I'd like to tell you about a fascinating new system my colleagues and I have discovered with the giant Parkes radio telescope. The Parkes telescope is in New South Wales in Australia, and is a prolific discoverer of special stars astronomers call pulsars. In November 2008, we started a very large survey of the southern sky looking for pulsars. Pulsars are neutron stars. They weigh about a half million times as much as the Earth, but are only 20 kilometers across. Their rotation makes them appear to pulse once per rotation period, and they spin up to an amazing 700 times per second. The radio waves from the pulsar travel across the galaxy and are focused by the dish in what we call the focus. In the focus is housed a very special receiver called the Parkes Multibeam Receiver, and we digitize the minute voltages induced by the pulsars 800 million times a second. In 2009, a 5.7 millisecond pulsar was discovered on our supercomputers, and our colleagues at Jodrell Bank soon realized that this star was orbiting another object every two hours. The motion of the pulsar told us that the companion only weighed about as much as Jupiter, and is incredibly dense, similar to that of platinum. The rapid spin of the pulsar tells us that the system once possessed a massive accretion disk, as the pulsar stripped matter from its stellar companion. The leftover of this star is what we see today as the planet. The evolutionary history and amazing density of the planet all suggest it's comprised of carbon, i.e. a massive diamond orbiting a neutron star every two hours in an orbit so tight it would fit inside our own sun.